<lacht> so, ich muss jetzt irgendwie hier wieder nach hier vorne gelangen. Alles klar. Dann mal nach oben. Sie hat eigentlich gesagt, sie müsste einfach nur zur Sicherheit, wollte sie auch das vierte wissen, aber... Hm. Oh ja, das Wappen ist total niedlich. Ein Bär, der nicht an die Äpfel am Baum dran kommt. Im Ernst? Du hättest bei Dürer eher auf den Kanickel getippt. Aha. Wie sie eine Pirouette gemacht hat, ne? Oh mein Gott. Baroness von Tribbets? Are you okay? Hallo? Baroness? Hallo? Oh, fuck. Adil. What happened? The Baroness. Blood everywhere. But who? I don't know. Inch? Th that doesn't make any sense. Oh, je, oh, wei. Oh, no! Du musst rein. Du musst da wieder rein. Ah, rauf! Oh, jetzt wird er geschnappt für sie. Zelna, up here. We've got our shadow. Who are you? I do nothing. Me crew. Sure you are. What are you doing here? Just fresh air. <sighs> <sighs> sure. You just wanted to get a breath of fresh air. Hmm. Oh nein, oh nein, oh nein. Zelna, look who we have here. Well, if that's not our shadow. And our stowaway. Were you recently traveling via trunk? I, uh, nothing. <laughs> He claims to be part of the crew. Just wanted to get some fresh air. Oh, sure. And you obviously didn't attack me either, did you? The Baroness won't open her door, sir. Understood. Take him to the detention cell, Robert. We'll talk later, my friend. Oh, da schlurft er dahin, der Adil. Tja, und jetzt? What is? Did nothing. Inspector Legrand thinks otherwise. Move. But I have... Gunshot. I know that. Get moving. Into the cell. Ah. Tipp, mach mal eine Pause, wenn du einfach nicht mehr weiterkommst. Arrest Hadil. Was? Ja. Arrest Hadil. <lacht> Was sich ähnlich anhört wie Arrest Hadil. Oha. Inch, was willst du? Oh, ich bin Inch jetzt. Oh no! Hello? Ich bin doch noch Adil. What what happened last night? What happened that you were walking around the ship? That you let them catch you? That you endangered the whole plan? That you endangered me? Aus Versehen. I didn't kill anyone. They arrested me purely by coincidence. They'll have to turn me loose in Cairo. I mean, someone was killed, weren't they? I heard a shot. Ah, fast er deal? <laughs> Why won't you answer? I'm having a conversation that you cannot hear. W what happened last night? The Baroness was murdered. Did... did you? No. If it were up to me, she'd have had an accident in a couple of weeks. Instead, someone shot the old bat in the heart point blank. Are we calling it off? No. 
Mr. X is ready, and as her surviving representative, I should be able to move about freely in the museum. The old hag's death doesn't change anything. How did you get in here? I'm more than capable of finding the entrance to a cargo hold. Indeed, it was child's play. <laughs> it's not as though I had to crawl through ventilation shafts or anything so gauche. So, what do we do now? I could escape and... Swim to Cairo. So, I stay here and wait? They'll arrest you in Cairo and question you about the murder. Even if they don't throw you in jail, it'll take days. And if we find the murderer, then they'd have no reason to hold me. Oh, <laughs> I'm one step ahead of you. Da kommt der Anton. Nervous? I would be if I were you. Den Dialog kennen wir ja, deswegen können wir den nicht nochmal führen. This Zellner chap wasn't part of the plan. I don't like it. He's groping about in the dark. Legrand is the real problem. Still, I'm going to take him out of the picture. How? Dr. Gebhardt killed the Baroness. A clever old man, but not clever enough to keep me from finding out. So you just have to tip Legrand off, and then I'm as good as free. That's what I thought at first, but then I thought, why waste the opportunity? I put Zelna on the trail of the good doctor. He'll drive Gebhardt into a corner, and when he lashes out in desperation, he might hit our Swiss friend. Maybe even Legrand, if we're really lucky. You can't do that. The old fella's just doing his job. And so am I. Inch, enough blood has been shed. Inch, no more deaths. Damn! I have to get out of here and warn Constable Zellner. Tja, dafür müssen wir jetzt erstmal rauskommen. Ich habe ja gar nichts mehr hier. <coughs> Lock looks pretty modern. Needs a small key, five pins. I could pick it with the right tools. Mhm. Mm Erstmal rankommen. Roll I didn't sleep a wink last night. All I could think of was Alex. It's terrible not knowing what happened. Nutze die Wolldecke mit ähm, zum Brett. Oh, da ist ein Nagel. Got caught on the nail. Na gut, dann nehmen wir den Nagel. A board and a nail. Fangen wir mit dem Nagel an. I doubt that will work. Muss es erst noch biegen, ne? Yep. The nail is much too thick to fit in the keyhole. Ah. Dann brauchen wir den Nagel, um irgendwas anderes damit erstmal zu holen. Die Wolldecke mit dem Nagel nicht. Ähm, da haben wir die Spinde. Stuhlbeine. Dinge an der Decke? Nee. Doch die Stangen. I guess this cage is some kind of detention cell for the crew. <lacht> it's not the most impregnable prison in the world, but it's still a problem. Hm. Ich damit was machen? Nee. Oder mit der Decke? Die irgendwie biegen hier oben? Na, no, auch nicht. Die Stangen. Ach so, allgemein. Alle Stangen sind hier mit gemeint. Ach so. Ich untersuche die Stangen, die Wolldecke. Das Auto und so. Stangen. Aha. Wolldecke mit Stangen geht nicht. Was haben wir hier? Ah. Ech, they're really spoiling me with this cup of metallic tasting water. <laughs> If I'm really lucky, they'll toss me a few crumbs of bread. Mhm. 
benutze den Becher mit dem Nagel. If I were able to hammer the nail flat, it would probably fit in the keyhole. But I'd need a hammer and anvil for that. The cup won't do. Mhm. Dann versuchen wir mal das hier mit mh, gar nichts anscheinend. Äh Was könnte denn mal unser Amboss sein? Becher mit dem geht nicht. Ach hier, mit den Stangen. In which the prisoners called their guards like this. <lacht> But it wouldn't help. I can't explain the situation to the Bobby without endangering the whole plan. Stangen. Ich hasse Stangen. Dung Jones. Ja, Schlangen. Schlangen. Ich hasse Schlangen. Untersuche die Stangen. Das mit den Stangen geht nicht. Damit geht es auch nicht. Und das geht auch nicht so richtig. Aha. Like everything else on this ship, the bars and hinges are showing their age, but they're still much too strong for me to kick the door open. No? I think it's working. <laughs> Aha. One down. I'll hang it back on the frame, and if I'm lucky, no one will notice my escape. Note! Wiley Coyote! Ob er mir ein Amboss leid. Ein Amboss fällt auf Plucky. 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 Ein großer Amboss fällt auf Plucky. Ja, ich war schon ein bisschen. Hm. Fasziniert von dieser Amboss auf Plucky Geschichte. Ist mir bis heute im Gedächtnis geblieben. Wiley Coyote. Ah, genau. Die Kransteuerung. Hm. Na? Was können wir denn da machen? Da ist das Ding runtergekommen. Aha. Hier irgendwas machen? Nein. Was haben wir denn hier jetzt noch? A good height for attaching something to the hook. A good height for attaching something to the hook. Ich dachte, ich kann da vielleicht jetzt dieses äh, Schott einhängen. Huh. What's that up there? Oh! A great sunlight shining through it. And above it a bent pipe This could be my way out Mhm, mm nur noch aufkriegen. Dafür brauchen wir jetzt bestimmt den Haken. The bars are welded at four points and unfortunately they're not all as rusty as this one. <lacht> so, das bringt nichts. So, den vielleicht wieder nach oben bringen. nach oben gehen. Öffne das Gitter. Ach, Adil. Not a chance. I have to come up with something and fast. Dr. Gebhardt has the means to get rid of an old man inconspicuously. So, hier haben wir nichts mehr. Ich das Regal hinunter. Ah, 
Das Teil können wir jetzt so in dem Zustand nicht benutzen. Okay, was haben wir denn hier sonst noch so? Hier haben wir noch so eine... K Durchsuche das Regal. Oh, auch gut. What's this? Beep, beep. Roadrunner, hast du gerne geguckt? Wow, heavy. Heavy. Everything's a bit bigger and heavier on a ship. Pulleys included. Umlenkrollen. Benutze die Umlenkrolle mit. Alles klar. Ich muss das Ding wohl erstmal wieder runterholen. Alles klar. I could do this all day. Ich auch. Benutze die Umlenkrolle mit diesem Haken. Aha. Huh. And now? And now? Klettere das Regal rauf. Ähm, tja, so wie es aussieht. Erstmal das hier wieder rauf. Oder? Ich hoffe. Und ich verauf da. Scheiße. Mist. Ach, dann kann ich ja gleich wieder runtergehen. Und vielleicht holen wir uns das Teil auch wieder runter. Ich glaube, wir müssen es noch anderweitig verwenden. Die Umlenkrolle. <lacht> Den ganzen Tag. So, nimm die Umlenkrolle. Ach so. I don't think that was the solution to the puzzle. Ja. Ich auch. Kann ich die nicht erst Kann ich die nicht nehmen und nach oben gehen? Nein, kann ich nicht. Ich kann sie hiermit benutzen. Ah. denn hier noch irgendwas? Ah, die Vertiefung. A ring set into the floor. You could attach ropes or chains to it. It's set into the floor to keep people from tripping over it. Mhm, okay. Dann nehmen wir das Ding mal damit. Dann nehmen wir das da. Good height for attaching something to the hook. I attached the pulley to the ring. You could hang a car from it if the ship were upside down. Aha. Können wir die beiden Sachen nicht miteinander verbinden? Height for attaching something to the hook. I attached the pulley. I attached the pulley to the ring. Okay, er macht's aber nicht mehr ab. Das heißt, das ist wohl richtig so. Nutze die Kransteuerung. Klettere die Regale hinauf. Ich gehe nochmal nach vorne. Vielleicht habe ich da was übersehen. Vielleicht hätte ich da was mitnehmen können. Vielleicht brauche ich aber auch jetzt das. Ähm die Decke, hm? hm? Betrachte die Zelle. Gute Nacht, Nahrim, süße Träume. As soon as Constable Zellner and Inspector Legrand are out of danger, I'll slip back into the cell. They'll arrest the good doctor and hopefully they'll turn a blind eye to a poor stowaway. Hm. Da, der Schlauch. Perfekt. Jetzt geht es. Fire still poses a great threat to ships. There are fire alarms, extinguishers and hoses everywhere nowadays. Mhm. Dann nimm doch mal was vom Schlauch. Perfekt. Ah, these hoses are pretty versatile. They'll do at a pinch if you can't smuggle climbing ropes into the building you're planning to rob. Mhm. Aber du hättest ruhig da bleiben können. Da, ich will doch schon rein in den Raum. Gut, jetzt benutzen wir das Seil damit. Oder auch damit. Und damit. Sehr schön. I attached the pulley to the ring. You could hang a car from it. If okay. Mit dem Gitter. Sehr schön. Und jetzt ziehen wir das nach oben und damit das Gitter auf. 
Jetzt das ruhig ein bisschen knapper bemessen können. Wow, da kannst du aber von Glück reden, dass das Ding nicht an Kopf gekriegt hat. I hope no one noticed. With luck, I'll be able to warn the others about the doctor before it's too late. Aha. Just. No. Oh. Hey, you you all right? <sighs> That bastard didn't inject the fatal dose. You'll be back on your feet soon enough. Oh. <sighs> Better take it easy while I. Oh no! Let's just have Oh my God! I'll be right back. Genau, folge ihn. Hurry up! <sighs> I can see Legrand in the saloon. I don't think Gebhard would have gone there. Okay, was ist hier mit? Was ist, wenn er genau jetzt hier in... Nicht. Na gut. Ich hatte gedacht, er wäre jetzt vielleicht extra in das ähm, Abteil der Baronin geflüchtet. Where are you? Komm mal hier. Oh, scheiße! Why can't you just leave me alone? Oh. Adil, guter Mann. <lacht> Und weiter. Ihm hinterher. Was macht er jetzt? Ist er doof? Stay there. Just relax. Why can't you just leave me alone? It is always the same old story. What old stories? I am a decent man. Why are you torturing me? I just... I... I loved her. She betrayed me. It was her fault. I have blood on my hands because of her. Are you talking about the Baroness? She... She was her sister. I loved her. With all my heart. They were Jewish, you know? But I didn't care about that. I hid them when it became dangerous for them. I looked after them. I brought them food. I was a party member. And still, I hid her and her whole family. You risked your life for a woman you loved. And 30 years later, you murder her sister? I saw her swollen belly. I was so angry. He was one of them, you know? They just used me. I hid them, brought them food, and in return they laughed about me behind my back. What did you do? There are Jews hiding in the basement of the Waldhof. Armed Jews. We have to burn them out. <sighs> and that's what they did. You had the whole family killed? I am a gentleman. And I expect that others... That... That they... They, they don't... She didn't love you. And was expecting a child by another man. And that's why you betrayed her. It... It, it was her fault. She shouldn't have cheated on me. I... I... I saved her. <sighs> I risked my life for her every day for for four months. And then you threw it all away and became a murderer. I am not. I am a murderer. Yeah, well, the dead Baroness in the ship's hold proves the opposite. I had never met her. Back in East Prussia, she was the older sister. The smart sister. She studied art history in New York. Tried to get her family out of East Prussia, but I was able to prevent that. You say you loved her, and yet you wanted to deny her and her family a safe life. They were safe. I protected them. 
It was for their sake that I joined the party. I had contacts. I wrapped them in my protective embrace. You didn't let her escape because you wanted to keep her close to you. She sent photos to her sister before the war. She must have recognized me yesterday in Venice. I certainly recognized her. The Baroness was searching through her photos. That's true. She couldn't get me during the war. And after the war, I disappeared. Gave myself a new name, a new resume, a new life. And then, suddenly, there she was. About to ruin everything. So, she had to die. I didn't want that. But she gave me no choice. Why did she have to stir up old ghosts? All, all right now. No, it ends here and now. Why do you want to kill yourself? Isn't it obvious? He can't bear his false, hollow life anymore. Who are you? What do you want? A man who understands etiquette and honor and yet is nothing but a coward himself. Who, because of wounded vanity, burdens himself with immense guilt. Don't come any closer. The Baroness held a mirror up to you, didn't she, Doctor? And you hated what you saw there. So you smashed the mirror. But the sins of the past are catching up with you now, aren't they? No. A skull with empty eyes full of fear. Stop it. Oh, dear. You really know how to dampen the mood. I almost had him. Ich and wollte ihn doch zum Aren't Selbstmord bringen. Are you supposed to follow bringen. orders? Are you not here to assist me? I won't. That wasn't a question. I don't want any dead bodies, but I don't understand why you're doing this. You don't have to. Watch and learn. No! No, no! What is it then? You wanted to jump anyway, or you should at least. Inch. I'm just lending a friendly hand. He's a coward. He needs a bit of motivation. Come on now, chop, chop, jump. You are the Baroness's butler, aren't you? I... I did not want to kill your mistress. Oh, ho, ho, nonsense. Forgiven and forgotten. If you don't mind my asking. There must be another solution. Why are you doing this? Nothing personal. Well, that's not entirely true. You're a miserable excuse for a human being, aren't you? But mainly, you're a means to an end. Your death will get Inspector Legrand off our backs. The Inspector? What do I have to do with him? Your letter. The one in which you confess to being the Raven and to killing the Baroness because she saw through your ruse. <laughs> That's absurd. Indeed it is. But people will believe almost anything if it suits them. The press will love it. Bold Inspector Legrand saves the day again. Interviews, medals, urgent telegrams from the capital. Our dear friend won't be able to escape the limelight. And by the time the commotion has ended, I'll be long gone. You can't kill him. Why not? He's a bastard, his death will help us, and he's a witness. If we let him go, we'll both go to jail. All the same, we're not going to kill him. You got us into this situation. And as long as I'm alive, I won't let anyone be killed in my presence. No. I have to do the dirty work for you in the museum, so you won't be shooting me or him. Very well, you win. Mm. What? Oh, never speak to me like that again, do you understand? I need you to steal the eye, but one day I could be overwhelmed by a feeling of hatred that will make me forget the eye. And there are worse things I could do than simply shoot you. I suggest you go back to your cell. You need to be fit for Cairo. I still have a confession to write. <laughs> 